All right, here we are at the stove. What I got going on here is uh, some some rendering pine sap. I'm rendering this down and just scraping off the bits of crud, that black stuff there, as it as it appears. Sort of disposing of it there. It's quite a mess. And uh, I'm gonna be making some uh, sort of little tinder balls out of this uh, cattail fluff. Alrighty. So let's uh, let's carry on, shall we? <laughs> but it is a lot cleaner scooped a lot of scooped a lot of crud out of there that's just you know grainy bits of bugs and cruddy wood bits Ugh. anyway so next step is to uh, take the cattail fluff and make a little ball and dip it in the pine pitch alrighty tinder now so that's the fluff with the with the pine sap I got some more of those guys over here and uh, yeah that's that was that was my plan today now I just got to test them okay here we are with a test of the pine pitch cattail fire starter I'm just going to use an open flame here because it's easier that way and I'm setting up in the sink. Put that there just so we don't worry. I already, already tried that little bit there. Don't pretend that's not there. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, here we go. That was very easy. Once you get it going, it's going. So you get a nice Nice energetic little flame there, and that's that's it's pretty energetic. And the bonus, watch this. This stuff is waterproof. Look at that. I've got water right on top. And it is not going out. So not only do you get a nice little energetic fire, you got waterproof fire. Alright. There you have it. Go out, get yourself some pine sap, some cattails. Render the sap and pull out all the crud. 
Mix in the cattails, spread it out, bust it up. You got yourself some uh, some homemade waterproof tinder. Well, that that this chunk right here, that's a uh, that's got some it's got some energy to it. Well, all right. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.